hey guys welcome back to my youtube channel my name is eniola and i do all things skincare beauty lifestyle yes a little bit of everything like that but today we are going to talk about skincare i sincerely apologize i went away without official leave and that's because i needed some time out to just rest recuperate and also focus on some other aspects of the business now to the topic of today how to get rid of dark body parts like your neck your hands your feet or if it's a sunburn that you are dealing with or if you are dealing with maybe like dark armpits now this is something that a lot of people keep sending us messages requesting for like okay and you're like i've watched all your videos can you recommend a product to help me get rid of someone can you recommend a product to help me get rid of my feet is darker than my body or my hands are darker than my body or my neck is just darker my face and my neck is darker than my body in this video i'm going to be addressing that now like i always say this is a disclaimer if you get easily upset if you get easily triggered and if you're going to be angry, do not watch this video because I like to be blunt and I'm going to come for you. Yes. Now, with that being said, let's get right into it. Now, this is also the best time for you to follow me on all my social media networks. I use TikTok and I use Instagram. Yeah, those two, basically. And I use Instagram. So you this is your chance to also follow me on those social media apps so that you can learn a lot i make a lot of educational content on there in short little clips that you're going to benefit from so follow now what's the number one reason let me talk about let, let's let's do it this way when we try to identify and fix a skin challenge the right thing to do is not just to go ahead and buy a product to fix it how about you sit down and find out what is causing those challenges that is the best attempt to skincare and that is the best attempt to fix your skin instead of thinking okay ah uh, i'm getting darker the option is to buy lightning products that's not the way to fix skincare issues you sit down and you ask yourself questions like what could be causing the skin concern that i have do you understand before you now figure out the solution to that problem that you have because if you go ahead and get a product and then you don't know that the problem that you are trying to identify or that you are trying to fix the challenge that you are trying to fix is internally inside you or is a result of something that is hormonal you will just be wasting your money plain and simple now what is the number one cause of dark feet dark hands sunburn and a little bit of darkness on the face on the neck on even skin tone attributing towards darkening this is the number one factor the darkness in your body parts is your skin's attempt to protect your skin from harmful sun ultraviolet burning and aging rays let me repeat that in layman's english do you know how sometimes you um try to sip hot tea do you get and then you blow at it first just to be sure that your tongue does not get burnt in the process that's your brain's mechanism of telling you oh hey and your lad this tea is hot and before we take something hot we blow it to be sure that it will not harm the tongue that is exactly what your skin mechanism is doing by getting you darker now let me explain again the dark layer on the skin or inside the skin surface called um melanocytes it's like a part of the skin that releases a pigment known as melanin now melanin is that natural pigment that your skin has that makes you white or makes you black do you understand so when you go into the sun your skin's natural mechanism to protect itself from the burning sensation and effects of the sun rays is to produce more melanin hey melanin hey melanin it produces more melanin in order to protect your skin and to keep your skin in check now the adverse effects of sun exposure can range from cancer to not just sunburn so you can see why those melanin stuff are very very important for your skin now what that melanin is also going to do is that it will, it will absorb the uv rays the radiation of the skin that causes free radicals and cancer it will absorb it like a blanket do you understand the side effect of what that does eventually is that those areas that are always in the sun will be darker than the rest of your body plain and simple it is not 
that the products that you're using is not working. It is that you're using product, but you're not fixing and protecting your skin from the sun. Now, let me read what I have here. The more you expose your skin to the sun without protection, the more melanin your skin releases and the darker your skin is going to get. Very simple. This is why a lot of people will say, uh, just give me something lightning, brightening, whitening, bleaching, and I just want to get my lightness back. I want to feel like I'm light again. I've gotten darker. No, you're asking for the wrong thing. And that's why the culture that we have in Nigeria today does not still support sunscreen. The we talk talking about sunscreen, I got a backlash. And I'm not the person with the skin. Hello, look at my skin. Take this advice and tip. In addition to the lightning products that you're going to be getting for your skin, don't just buy lightning products expecting that they will miraculously work and fix those dark areas. Get sunscreen. Apply sunscreen on your elbow if that is what is dark. Apply it on your hands if that is what is dark. Apply it on your neck, on your face if that is what is dark. Apply it on your feet if that is the area of your skin that is always exposed to the sun and that gets sun tanned and that gets sunburned and that gets dark. This is what you are supposed to do to reduce that darkening. Now you already have the darkening. Going forward, you know how to prevent it. But how do you cure the issues that you have currently? Let's talk about that. The first thing that you want to do is to exfoliate. Now, exfoliation helps to get rid of dead skin cells on the surface of the skin, right? Now, when you exfoliate, especially with a brightening exfoliating scrub, not only are you getting rid of the dead skin cells, but you're also going to be revealing fresh skin. Now, the brightening pigments in your exfoliating scrub, take for instance the one from my brand, for example, will not only exfoliate your skin, but will stop the melanocytes from producing excess melanin. Now, this is the trick. Don't just exfoliate and go into the sun and say, Hi, I'm back. You are only going to make your skin worse than it was before. This is why some people start using lightning products and it looks like, ah, their skin took a backward turn from what it used to be to what it is now. That's because in addition to that, when you exfoliate, you're supposed to not only apply the exfoliating scrub, but you're supposed to moisturize and sun protect. This is very, very important. The next tip that I have here now is this. If the darkening is on areas of your face that are very, very visible to the sun, you want to start using aloe vera gel. Aloe vera gel is a soothing, calming, completely hydrating, natural product that not will get into the skin, suppress the release of melanin on the surface of your skin, like inside your skin, do you understand? So that you don't keep getting darker and then it will gradually re reduce the pigmentation that your skin has. I tried this trick, my sister. Everything that I'm telling you, I have used it before. And that is why my skin is the way it is now. Gone are the days when you will use skincare products without sunscreen. Let's talk about some skin lightening acids that you can use. We've talked about the fact that in addition to your lightening products, you need to use a sun protection. But these are the acids that you can add to your skincare routine, to your skincare products, or you look out for in skincare products in order to ensure that you start to gradually reduce the pigmentation on those areas. Number one is glycolic acid. It is brightening and it actually works. Number two is cortic acid. And this is my favorite because you can add it into your body lotion. It's in um, soaps, it's in lotion. Sometimes it can even be synthesized to be infused in serum-like portions. Do you understand? But I would advise that you don't do home economics practical in your house. Look out for these ingredients and in products that you are getting for your skin. The last one is vitamin C. I've raved about this not once or twice. So these acids are going to work hand in hand. Do not attempt to use one, two, three acids at go. No, pick just one, be consistent and be ready to give those skin areas time to heal. The issue with people is this. So you try a skin lightening product, it doesn't work for you simply because what you want to achieve is that you want to be fair. Not using sunscreen, even when you're using the lightning products and you expect it to work.
Honestly, sister, you expect that lightning product to work for you. It doesn't work that way. In addition to your lightning product, two factors are involved. You need to give your skin time and you also need to use enough sun protection. This is what will allow you to see results as fast as possible. If you're not giving your skin time, and I'm talking three months, six months, a year, with a lightning product consistently, you will not like the changes or you will not see the kind of changes that you want to see. And then in addition to that, you need to use enough sun protection. Please, enough sun protection. I have given you guys my sunscreen recommendations. Watch the video. It's up on my YouTube too. Check it out. Watch it. Get one of those sunscreens and start using it for not just your face, on your neck, on your hands. I use sunscreen on my hands. I use sunscreen on my hands because I don't want to start to have a fresh face and then your neck is looking agad. You have wrinkles on your neck or your neck is dark and your hands are dark. It is sun exposure that causes all those things. Please, I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. I hope you guys learned a lot. Remember to drop your questions down below. I'll be looking forward to reading them in the comment section. Thank you so much for watching this video. Subscribe to this channel. Get us to 1,000 followers. Subscribers. Subscribers. And I'll, I'll talk to you guys in the next one. Bye. Um, just give me something lightning, brightening, whitening, bleaching. And I just want to get my lightness back. I want to feel like I'm light again. I've gotten darker. No. You're asking for the wrong thing. And that's why the culture that we have in Nigeria today does not still support sunscreen. The first sunscreen on my hands. I use sunscreen on my hands because I don't want to start to have a fresh face. And then your neck is looking agad. You have wrinkles on your neck or your neck is dark and your hands are dark. It is sun exposure that causes all those things.